So tell us what you guys found. You found a praying mantis. Praying mantis. Okay, so let's take a look. Let's put the praying mantis down. And what did you name your praying mantis? Jason, um, Jason Alex Smith. Jason Alex Smith. Okay, so this is Alex. And Alex came to our front door a couple days ago. And the kids were interested in Alex because the wings didn't seem to be working. So we took Alex in. And what did we discover about Alex? That he doesn't fly. And what else? He's injured. Yes, but what happened? What did, what did Alex do to the top of the cage? He laid a cocoon and of eggs. And, and if it hatches, there will be possibly fly. There, there could be five or or how be, many hundreds? There could be five or hundreds or even. More. So Alex is actually not a boy. Alex is what? A girl. A girl. So Alex actually laid a cocoon of an egg sac here. I forgot what it's actually called. It's, it was here. And um, we safely removed it. And we're gonna put it somewhere safe in a tree. We'll show you the sack later. Right now we're just outside playing. And sometimes we like to take Alex outside and let her hang out. And we find bugs for her to eat. What kind of bugs does Alex eat? Spiders, spiders, small birds, <laughs> spiders, small birds, worms, and flies. Okay. Okay, we just found Alex a worm outside for her to eat. And you can see she is in position. She is preying on her food. They like to watch and stalk their food for a little bit before they attack. And so she's in position, ready to devour. We just go in the front yard and we just find different insects for her to eat. This is the uh, egg sac that Alex laid inside of this cage and we safely removed it. And we're gonna find a tree outside to put it on so that it can hatch safely. Um, you can't put these on the ground because they will be eaten by ants, so we will find somewhere safe for this.